Boys, oh yeah, oh yeah. Boys, oh yeah, oh yeah. All right, uh, congratulations to two of our Super Eagles players. Let me say that all they just gained promotion back to the English Premier League, which is the top tier of the English football. They're talking about none other than uh, Kelechi Iyanacho and uh, uh, Wilfred Ndidi. Yes, but the issue now be say, just as we celebrate two of our Super Eagles players, we say they just recently gained promotion back to the English Premier League. Now, we they are the verge of having two Super Eagles players as well getting relegated to championship, uh, championship which is the lower division of the uh, uh, English League. I talk about uh, Taiwo Awoni and Ola I know. Yes, uh, many of you remember Ola I know, uh, for, uh, especially for those of you that we follow this last AFCON. Ola I know, one of our powerhouse we, we uh, help us for this last AFCON. But as it stands now, uh, a couple like say the fans of Super Eagles they get mixed feelings because as we they celebrate too, they say especially me personally. Uh, but it sweet me as uh, Leicester City don't gain promotion back to the English Premier League. Although small issue day for that uh, the Leicester City side, though I, I they come to that issue now. But we they celebrate the promotion of with uh, as Leicester City just gain promotion back to the Premiership. Uh, but we see they are the verge of losing two. Uh, of our players, they play for Nottingham Forest because as it stands just now, uh, Nottingham Forest just the only one point above the relegation zone. Just one point that they take the past Luton Town. Yeah, and you know, say Luton Town they play match today against Everton. So right now, I know say all the time we are only and the rest of the dudes better serious fast and pray that they pray make Everton win Luton Town today so that they don't go climb above them. Uh, tomorrow now. Uh, Chef, uh, Nottingham Forest now they get match against Sheffield United, which is uh, if you ask me, uh, if you say Nottingham Forest they strong past Sheffield United. As a matter of fact, if like I say Nottingham Forest, he take the chances where they get last weekend against Manchester City, they will not lose that match. Forget about other Arsenal or anything. But right now, uh, their destiny did their own hand. If they go feel win their remaining matches where they get, they will stay. They not go go relegation. Uh, but if they're not going to feel when there are many matches where they get, they need to do serious fasting and prayer. They hope, see, uh, Sheffield United and Burnley, they, and, sorry, they hope, see, Luton Town and Burnley, because Sheffield, those ones, their feet already, they see, they, they go, they, they, they go back to center. They, 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 now, nothing for you to hope, see, uh, Burnley and Luton Town, they continue to the drop points so that they will stand chance to remain for the premiership because we know we would like to make our super egos players we like to see our our boys they play for the top flight leagues for europe you understand so you know go good make especially someone like ola i know ola i know a very good player obviously you go fit even fit into any club that is just the truth now utility player obviously if you put them for left back you go deliver a poly unit if you put them for right back you go deliver a poly unit sometimes if they will play flank you get so that kind of player i did you know go come good see that kind of player come go relegation go to play for championship no but and the, as I told you, it's a small issue day for that Leicester City side. Now, the issue with day for that Leicester City side now with a uh, senior man chaos. Yes, that's Kelechi Ian Acho because the GC the boss has done that. Leicester City still get serious begay with Kelechi Ian Acho since this AFCON they play for January, February. Yeah, what's in this? What is so? Now, during that AFCON period, Kelechi Ian Acho get small injury. We'll be saying the injury could go so finish. If another injury, I keep him away enough to play during the group stages. During the group stage of that AFCON, but he can't play for the later stages. Now, Leicester City is say, no, make it make it stay now. We'll be your club because they with us, not go your country, not go, not go represent your country for AFCON. Can you say no? Say Nigeria na a country. Say in no fee, lose guard the country because of one club. He can lose guard the club. Come still use up on head. Go play. Go come AFCON. Go play for AFCON. At least, if at all, he gets silver medal to show his children. Let us say sweet away you know, for AFCON. What go? You get to the point now. But since then, if you watch Leicester City match, if they follow Leicester City match, they hardly even play Kelechi and Acho since that time come because of this uh, big game with the sub between Kelechi and Acho and the club. And they don't even talk and now say, the next moment when we now say, once season ends now, they go let the guy go on free transfer. They don't even re they don't renew the guy contract. Say that they the invest on the guy's roster. So as uh, season ends, uh, Kelechi and Acho, it will likely go another club. But the truth of the matter, we say at least Kelechi and Acho will feel fit into most of the mid table clubs for the Premiership, if at all. So that will not be too issue. So we we'll celebrate with Fred But the question we want to ask on the so if you be Kelechi and Acho, or this thing we Kelechi and Acho do so, we be say he choose country over club. You feel say he make the right decision, or you feel say since that the club that they pay him his salary pass, 
the book of Salah. If you say in for your obey club, stay with the Jelly. Let us know in the comment section. Anyway, just thank God for everything.